As a fellow Muslim, I have to pray at least five times a day, once in the morning, two in the afternoon, and two more at night. If you do come across a Muslim doing prayer, you would probably see him or her on a prayer rug, or as I like to call it, the Janama. So far, I've been praying for my entire life, and when I do, I always grab my colorful Janamas, set it down, and begin my prayer. Since doing this has become a big part of my life, I've grown very attached to it and usually treat it with gentle care. I'm also not the only one as many other Muslims also treat the Janamas with gentle care and think of it as a symbol of Islamic culture. I've been praying so much on my prayer mat that I don't even remember the first day of when I started doing it. It is almost like second nature when trying to pray. Without thinking, I just grabbed it and began my prayer. For centuries, fellow Muslims have been united together as they pray on their mats. Today, many different patterns are embedded in the prayer rug to show many different symbols of building the prayer. It has not only become an object of Islam, but a symbol of art. For you to understand why this means so much to me, you will first need to learn why it means so much to all Muslims. A prayer rug can date back to about a thousand years and mostly thrived during the Ottoman era. Even before Muslims started praying on it, it had become widely popular as an artistic object that was usually hung across many homes and was mostly used as flooring. Of course, when Islam started to become popular and well-known, these same mats were thriving as they were being used as a way to pray without getting dirty. Many families, including me, would start buying these mats and using them and passing them down from generation to generation, leading us right here. Prayer rugs also really emphasize Islam as they allow people to add their designs and colors to make the jamas look pretty. Mine usually has sacred scripts or images of very important landmarks that are connected to Islam. Another thing that is usually added to the prayer rug is the mihrab, which is usually knitted into the upper end to indicate where the person has to place their head. You see, when a Muslim is doing prayer, they have to go into something called sijda, which is when they get on their knees and place their head on the floor. This is another reason why the Janamas was created as they allowed people to place their heads without getting them dirty. When I was younger, I hated to pray since I was pretty clumsy. As I've said, I've been praying on a Janamas for almost my entire life to the point it has become second nature. The feeling of washing your body, picking up the mat, and laying it down facing the makkah and praying. All it gives me is a sense of discipline and calmness. Not only does it give me a bond to my religion, but it gives me a bond to my community. It allows me and my people to unite with each other. On the days when I feel lost or just even down from the things going on in my outside life, the prayer mat serves as a symbol of distraction and peace. It allows me to unravel myself and eliminate my worries from the troubling world. Like others that celebrate Islam, it serves as a reset button to make you feel fresh once again, giving me a sense of belonging and letting me know that people can share the same struggles that I am forced to go through. This also provides a sense of identity of what group of people I am a part of. Today, many Muslims around the world use the prayer mass to unite with each other in many different ways. Not only is it used for praying, but to express many symbols and landmarks of Islam. It can also be used as an art. The prayer mat seems of so much to the people of Islam and so much to me and my family. Whether we are at home, a mosque, or even on the other side of the world, every time we go to pray, there would be a janamas that we could stand on. So, even if you don't pray or celebrate Islam, you can still use these vibrant mats to make sure your home is a bit more colorful. Maybe you can even make your own as a nice hobby to pass some time. Thank you.